Hello and welcome back to Let's Play a Carrier Deck. We will be continuing with the North Atlantic campaign today with certification, enemy attacks, enemy detection, enemy interception, and electronic warfare. Hostile aircraft detected. Enemy aircraft has been detected. We need to launch a mission to intercept it before it comes within striking distance of the carrier. Click on the enemy aircraft that has been detected in the air channel, then click the Q button in the launch box to confirm the mission. Select an aircraft that corresponds to the aircraft in the launch box, F-18. Once the aircraft action menu, sorry, open the aircraft action menu and load it for an air mission and then launch it. So we see they're uh, loading up our Hornet right now. And he's all loaded. So let's launch him because if you let him get... Normally he doesn't hit your carrier until he's off this track. But I found that the tutorial will kill your mission if he makes it to this box. The aircraft is now en route to intercept the enemy threat. The enemy threat is destroyed once the intercept aircraft reaches it. So basically as long as your launch gets them before they they make it off all the way through the track, you're good. Unless well, again, you're in the tutorial, in which case if he makes it to like here, you fail. <laughs> I don't know why, but... Enemy surface ships and submarines also attack the carrier, so it's advisable to keep search missions airborne in each of the channels in the radar. So, we see they already have um, missions for air and surface, so... Whenever an aircraft lands, a buzzer will sound to remind you to clear the runway. So let's bring them in. And we'll park him where he was before. So we can get a helicopter search up. And I believe this is the only lane that you can't actually fully reveal the lane. Now let's search for enemy submarines. Submarine. Click on the submarine search button and queue the mission in the launch box. Load a helicopter for our submarine mission and launch it. Great. I broke it. I broke the tutorial. That's okay. We got more helicopters down here. I'll just bring one up because I'm sure we'll find something and we'll have to launch a helicopter. But here's a better view of what I was talking about last episode where boop, it's parked. Now we can move it up. Good to go. There we go. Keep your eye on the radar while the helicopter is searching for an enemy target. You can hold spa the space key to speed up time. Hostile submarine detected. Okay, so let's... An enemy submarine has been detected. Click on the enemy submarine to initiate a submarine mission in the launch box. Cue the mission, then load and launch the helicopter to intercept the enemy submarine. So we'll queue them up. Mission confirmed. And launch. I'm really glad we brought that other helicopter up now. Enemy warship has been detected. We need to launch a mission to intercept it before it comes within striking range of the carrier. Whenever an enemy target requires three or more aircraft to intercept, it needs to be preceded by an electronic warfare mission, electronic warfare. Click on the enemy warship and you'll notice two, two missions appear in the launch box. In the future, you can cycle. Now load the S-18 with uh, electronic warfare mission and three F-18s with surface missions. Launch the aircraft as they get to the catapults. Once the mission has intercepted the enemy surface threat, land the mission. Okay, I, I missed that, but I think it's just say you could change which aircraft you can use. So like, you know, we could have used all Super Hornets. I, I don't like how they refer to these as S-18s. But. I mean, to me, they look kind of almost like they should be growlers, but, well, except for the fact that they're single-seater. So these are, and they belong to a non-existent experimental squad, apparently. I don't know, I feel like they could have paid a little more attention to detail with that. But... All right, and good to go. 
There they go. That cruiser group doesn't stand a chance. And we'll bring you back here. Boom. Enemy fleet destroyed. Well, I, I, I hesitate to call it a fleet. I would a task force at best, most likely. But. All right, so let's bring them in one at a time and uh, line them up where they were. And let's bring back our helicopter. Uh, you should be safe now. Should be safe. If you do bring them in, well, there's one. Like, if I were to just leave them here and bring this guy in, they will crash and explode and cause damage to your carrier and some of the surrounding stuff, too. Alright. That's probably good enough. Perfect. And with that, the level is complete, so. We will complete the level here. Victory North Atlantic 4, certification enemy attacks, 5 star rating, we have reached a new rank of Petty Officer 2nd Class. So that's it for today's episode, we have one more mission until we are out of the North Atlantic campaign, so thank you all for watching and stay tuned for next time and we'll see you then.